Hey, we get lots of questions about what Greek life is like here at Butler. So I live in a sorority called Pi Beta Phi, and I'm gonna take you guys on a little tour of my house. So here's the outside. Here's the new wing. This is the older part that's been around since the 1920s. So now we're gonna go inside and check out right over the front door. That's where my bedroom is. Now we're inside. We have seven sororities at Butler and we all have houses. Um, freshmen don't live in the houses. They stay in their dorms after they rush. Um, but sophomores generally live in the house, sometimes all the way through senior year. So it's just kind of a different housing option that a lot of us like. So I'm gonna take you around the main floor first. We're in the lobby, foyer, whatever, right now. Here's the staircase. There you can see our crest of our fraternity. It's actually a fraternity for women is the technical name of it. Pi Beta Phi is the one that I'm in. Have our little entryway. And here we're going into the formal living room. It's kind of dark in here right now just because everybody's at class. But this is just a nice area. Um, it's pretty quiet usually. You can study in here, you know, if you have guests over, this would be a nice place to sit and chat. We have this cute little, you know, fireplace area. Um, music majors sometimes like to play the piano in here. But this is just more a formal space. Sometimes we have committee meetings in it. This space is usually really loud um, because this is our dining room. And I know it's kind of dark in here. Like I said, everybody's at class. Lucky me, don't have afternoon classes. But this is where we eat. As you can see, we have a bunch of tables. Um, and then we have buffet style food that'll be over here. We have a cook that makes all of our meals during the week. And it's really great. I mean, you know, dorm food is tolerable, but sorority food is really good. And we all love our cook to death. Her name's Tamika, and she's awesome. Um, here we have the informal living room, which is like our favorite place. I wish I could turn some lights on for you guys. Okay, here we go. Hold on. All right, this is the informal living room. <laughs> so we have couches and our favorite part, ta-da, flat screen TV. We just got that this fall and we're really excited about it because you know, it's great for watching movies. And so this is like Grey's Anatomy Central on Thursday nights as well as some other shows, Lost, uh, you know, stuff like that. And movie nights and of course, we have Guitar Hero, very popular pastime right now. Those are actually my roommates. She's really good at it. I'm terrible. All right, here we go. The best room ever. It's room two. We just did our bulletin board last night and we're really excited about it. It's Hollywood themed. Here's my roommate, Katie. Here's me and Jill. And I love them. They're two of my best friends and I'm really excited that I get to live with them. So, and we're also really pumped about our bulletin board. We have a JT Fergie. Katherine Hepburn, you know, all of our friends. Oh, and of course, you gotta have Jennifer Garner because she was a pie fi so here she is hanging out with me. So, oh, here's Katie. Welcome, welcome <laughs> to room two. <laughs> also known as the Ruth Reed Johnson room. Oh, how factual. <laughs> I know. Yeah. It's apparently the best room in the house because, well, we live here. And yeah, very spacious. Yeah, this is a really nice room actually for three people. We're really excited about it. We have the view right over the stairwell, which is kind of fun because you can hear people coming in and all their conversations. Um, we, you'll notice we don't have beds in here. That's because all of our beds are upstairs in one room called the cold dorm. We have a couple rooms that have beds in them if you want, but <coughs> most people like the cold dorm better because um, then you can just go to sleep whenever you want. It's always dark, it's always quiet. So you can see we have our three desks. We all get our own space. <laughs> Sorry, this is awkward that I'm in your face. That's okay. <laughs> we also have a coffee table with our beautiful dinosaur centerpiece. Yeah, we just built this coffee table last night. We're kind of excited about it. It was from Ikea. <laughs> <laughs> and dogs. then, all right, here's our obsession of the moment. That's the defining characteristic of room two. Lost marathons. Lots of fun. We just got into season one. Oh, here you can see what our closet looks like. Don't look at my closet. <laughs> <laughs> I have way too many clothes, so I had to add another rack, but that's just my problem. <laughs> so, lots of space. I actually have more space than I know what to do with, which is kind of a nice problem for me. So, yeah, that's pretty much what our rooms are like. The rooms come with the dressers and the couch and the desk chairs and all that, so pretty much set. Okay. 
All right, now we are on our way to the best room in the house. Um, Kay found and I usually like to go there at around two in the morning. Um, let's take a look. Your hair is so bouncy. <laughs> it is, I have curly hair. Okay, we are in the kitchenette. Here's Wendy, Ooh, Say hi. Hey, Wendy. Hey guys, what's up? What you doing? <laughs> I'm making coffee. Ooh, it smells good. It does smell really good. We're going to scan the cereal options. Wheaties we for your fiber. <laughs> um, crunch and berries for your childhood. <laughs> and um, honey nut Cheerios. Honey nut Cheerios for the in between. That's me. And fruit. And and pop tarts. You can and get those. oh, so many condiments like honey and ketchup mustard. And the cool thing is that we have these two fridge refrigerators here. Uh -huh. Um, and one has leftovers that our cook leaves for us so that we can have those when we get hungry. And this one is for our food, so mm -hmm. if we have stuff that we want to keep cold. We have an ice machine, we have a convection oven. I don't recommend it because I almost burned the house down once. She really did, and then she tried to blame it on someone else. <laughs> but I caught true. her. Okay, okay, so maybe that's not true, but, <laughs> but we like to make up stories. The fire department did come, and it was kind of funny. We recycle. I, yeah, we do. We're really big on recycling, which is sweet because I love trees. Okay, so... Is there anything else we need to show them at Pi Pi? Probably. Not. I don't know, but I'm gonna cut now. <laughs> All right. Well, thanks for joining me on our little tour of the house. I wish that it was more like around dinner time, so there were lots of people around, and you could see what the house is really like when it's really animated. But it's a really fun place to live. It's a cool residence life option to live with lots of friends and um, and have the good food and you know, I don't know. It's different, but it's cool. It's not for everybody. But I like it. So I hope you enjoy the tour and read my blog. And you can hear more about Greek life. Okay, bye.